the government uh, welcomes the RBI's decision to reduce the repo rate uh, to 6.75 from 7.25 percent. There will be a need to have a, a constant vigilance now on the inflation front. This uh, decision of the RBI actually implies that uh, inflation pressures have moderated significantly and are now within the comfort zone. The government is uh, fully committed in meeting the fiscal deficit targets in order to consolidate the gains uh, achieved by the contained inflation. This decision of the RBI will significantly provide policy support to the real economy and help in the recovery process. We are looking forward uh, now to the transmission of these cuts which will uh, effectively help to boost confidence and investment. Indian corporates would also now be able to raise uh, external commercial borrowings through rupee denominated offshore bonds with no end use restrictions. This would uh, enable them to get additional source uh, of resources. The government is looking forward to the transmission of these cuts to the rest of the economy and uh, uh, I think uh, we will hopefully see some uh, measures soon. But uh, as the RBI also indicated, the government will work uh, with all, all the concerned parties to facilitate this transmission, including by review, reviewing, as the governor said, the framework of small savings. Um, the, the, the second point, and it's related to what uh, the secretary just said, is that Part of the transmission of monetary policy, you know, part of it works through, you know, uh, what the banks are going to do, but part of it also has to work through how market rates themselves come down. And that's why increasing the, the GSEC limits uh, is, is part of, you know, bringing down market rates, uh, you know, help GSEC rates come down, and therefore uh, uh, this will also happen. The, 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 the third point to note also is that I think the boost to the economy will obviously come from the confidence and investment that comes from the rate cut, but also, you know, uh, the uh, RBI has clearly signaled that it still continues to be in an accommodative policy stance, uh, so that, you know, that should also reinforce confidence and hope that there can be more investment going forward.